Hi guys, welcome to another presentation. You've um, clicked on this video to solve how to how to work out how to work out solving this square. Um, this video was requested to me today, and I thought it would be best if I got this out today, even though I was pretty busy. But I do hope this helps. I'll make another video apart from this. This is just um, let's just say it's going to be a bit rushed, but I'm going to get the main points through. Let's start off by writing the form in which completing the square takes. Completing the square is basically x squared plus 2bx plus b squared. But if we do this one here, it's basically x plus b squared minus b squared. This is the generic form you want to remember. This is basically completing the square. You notice this is a 2bx. So whenever we do b, we're always going to take half of this of the coefficient of x over here. So if we were to if we were given x squared plus eight x and it said complete the square for the following equation, you want to make it into this form. Therefore, it will literally be x. Just remember, every time you see completing the square, half this always. Even if it's five, just do five over two. It will work. So half of eight is four. Keep the plus sign there and square. Okay. And it says here in the form minus b squared, which is minus 4 squared, which is minus 16. That has been completed. The square has been completed. That's actually how simple it is. And it's going to do another example. Let's just see. x squared plus 12x. In fact, pause it right now and get a piece of pen and paper or something and try to do this question and then play it because I'm going to give the solution right now. So the first step we need to do is obviously remember our form. We're just going to half it simply into the brackets x plus 12 divided by 2 equals 6 into squared. 6 squared is 36. And that is pretty much completing the square. Now you can get harder questions such as 2x squared minus 10x. And once again, just pause it for a second and work this out. Normally what I do for these kind of questions is, because we want to get x plus 4 in the brackets, I just divide everything by 2 and get rid of it. So if you divide x squared by 2 and put it into the bracket, you're going to get x, so not uh, plus, just undo that, uh, minus, um, so half of 10, which is 5, because this is, this we need to divide it. But we, this, this is where it gets confusing, basically. If you worked it out and you didn't get the answer, remember this is already in the form 2bx. So this becomes 5, and then we divide it by 2. So it's literally 5 over 2 squared. Um, just be careful about that, because it could be tricky. And then you want to do take away 5 over 2 squared. Normally working in fractions is easier. Um, trust me, <laughs> trust me, it really is. Because when you get onto a higher level maths, it will help a lot. And then this simply becomes x minus 5 over 2 squared. Take away 5 squared is 25 over 2. That's your answer. And that is pretty much completing the square. Um, I hope this helps. If it doesn't, please tell me. Uh, please. Uh, rate and comment. I'll be creating another video on completing this uh, the square for sure. Harder examples, more complex examples. Um, thank you for watching.